Hi Virgo, this reading is for you if you're in love with or have a crush on someone and would like to know how they feel about you. I'll do two spreads. In the first spread we'll try to see if they feel the same way about you, then if the feelings are mutual in the second spread we'll look at the potential between you and this person. Or if their heart is with someone else in the second spread we'll see who is coming towards you in the near future. Please like, share and subscribe to support this channel. All right, Virgo, let's see what's going on with the person on your mind. We have the Five of Cups, clarified by the King of Cups. Uh, we have the Ace of Pentacles, uh, clarified by the Knight of Pentacles. We have uh, the Queen of Pentacles, clarified by the Hermit. And we also have the World on the bottom of the deck. Um, you could be dealing with a Water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces. Um, or a fellow Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Right, so this is a tricky situation. I see two scenarios here, but I'll focus on just one of them for the most part. So the first scenario, you could be dealing with uh, an earth sign, a new person coming in. But uh, you may still be recovering from um, a failed relationship or marriage that you had with this King of Cups, the first card that came out. And uh, the earth sign that's coming towards you, they really want you, they're serious about you, but you'll need to think about it. You'll need to think about it no matter what the scenario is, by the way. In scenario number two, you're dealing with just one person, and uh, that would be the king of cups, right? And uh, perhaps this is somebody from your past, or they could be recovering from something that happened to them, or... Uh, they could be your ex or they could be somebody who missed an opportunity with you. And uh, that left a bitter taste in your mouth. right? And uh, that's why you'll need to think about this offer. Um, so I'll focus on the second uh, scenario where you're dealing with just one person, this King of Cups. I usually go with a king and a, or a queen if one shows up. And yeah, we got the King of Cups. Most likely a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces. They, or they may have a lot of water in their chart. Uh, the King of Cups is clarifying... The Five of Cups. The Five of Cups has always to do with the past, right? So it could be your ex um, regretting, grieving, not having you in their life, right? Or uh, it could have been somebody who missed an opportunity with you in the past. And uh, now they're realizing they made a mistake and uh, they're coming towards you. They're coming towards you either way with a very, very serious offer. The Ace of Pentacles, clarified by the Knight of Pentacles, it's that offer right there. Um, I don't think it gets any serious than that. <laughs> the Ace of Pentacles often comes through as a proposal, by the way, uh, Virgo, right? Um, if this is your ex, then it would make sense, because I see this all the time when people think that the only way to get somebody back is to propose to them, and it sometimes works, Virgo. To be fair, it works every once in a while. Um, but uh, if it's not a proposal, then the Ace of Pentacles is still uh, the most serious, the most grounded Ace. And so is the Knight of Pentacles, clarifying it. The Knight of Pentacles is the most serious and the most grounded Knight out of all four Knights. You see how the Knight of Pentacles is holding up a Pentacle, right? That's exactly the Pentacle we see in the Ace of Pentacles. In the Ace of Pentacles, we're, we're like zooming in on that offer. But again, it, it doesn't, in my opinion, it doesn't get any serious than that. When the Ace of Pentacles is clarified by the Knight of Pentacles or vice versa. Okay? Then we have you, the Queen of Pentacles. As I was clarifying the Queen of Pentacles, I asked how will Virgo feel about what's going on, and the Hermit showed up. <laughs> what's interesting, what's fun, well, kind of funny, is that the Hermit is your major arcana card, right? <laughs> so this is a confirmation that that's you. At the same time, the Hermit, uh, since you're coming in in this reading twice, that means you're the one, you're definitely the one in charge, you're definitely the one calling the shots, or perhaps with the Hermit card, you need to think about it, right? That's what the Hermit is. The, the Hermit is a thinker, somebody who needs to go within, do some soul searching, wrap their head around this offer, and things like that. So yeah, you will need you will need time to think it through either way. The world on the bottom of the deck, this is my happy end card. So you'll just have to decide what would be the happy end for you. Is it going to be together with this King of Cups, or is it going to be with somebody else at some point in the future. Okay, so... Yeah, we're at the crossroads right now. Um, I'm gonna look at the uh, potential between you and this person in the second... Uh, in the second spread. I'm not gonna be looking at any, anybody new, even though you will need time to think about it, and I think the universe wants you to make up your mind on your own. I still wanna see... <laughs> 
the potential between you and them. All right. Here's the potential between you and uh, the person we saw in the previous spread Virgo. We have uh, the five of wands clarified by the ten of wands. Uh, we have strength, the three of wands clarified by the six of pentacles and uh, the king of cups. And uh, we also have the two of cups on the bottom of the deck. Well, the king of cups showed up again. That was the very last card that I pulled out. It's a clarifier, right? Um, I'm going to give it a 50-50 Virgo. Please don't hate me. <laughs> but... Um, it's a it's a fifty fifty. If you want it, it's it's yours. If you want this, you will have to have courage. I can tell you that. And it's gonna it's a struggle for you to uh, give this person a, a chance or a second chance. It is a struggle. We got the uh, five of ones by five by the ten of ones. Uh, yeah, the five of ones is a card of a mental struggle in this case. I think that's you. The ten of ones is a card of a burden. So it is going to take a toll on you. Strength could be a Leo you're dealing with, but strength is all about courage. Perhaps strength is a card of loyalty as well. So it's a, it's a matter of loyalty, whether you believe this person or not, or it's a matter of what they did to you in the past, or whether you can believe that they will, they will be or remain loyal to you. Right? Um, yeah. The Three of Wands clarified by the Six of Pentacles and the, the King of Cups. The, the Three of Wands is a card of somebody who made up their mind, somebody who made a decision, and I think that's you. The, the Six of Pentacles is a card of a equal give and take, it's a card of balance, and at the same time, it is a card of a choice. Alright, it is a card of a choice, and uh, uh, the King of Cups is, <laughs> is there, right? Um, that's you making up your mind about this King of Cups. The Two of Cups on the bottom of the deck, however, is a great card. It is a card of a soulmate connection. So yes, you do have feelings, you still have feelings for this person, and that's why it's such a struggle for you. So again, it's a 50-50 Virgo. If you want it, it's there. If you don't, then uh, you can move forward in life, and perhaps another person will show up in your life. Um, so yeah, it all comes down to what I was saying at the end of the first spread, the happy end. Alright, do you want the happy end with this person or perhaps with somebody else in the future? Yeah, like I said, don't hate me, I hate to leave you hanging like this, but it truly is up to you. Alright? <laughs> um, so yeah, that's what I have for you, uh, Virgo, for this reading. Uh, for this month. If this video resonates with you, please like it. Please also share and subscribe. And uh, other than that, Virgo, have an amazing December. And there you have it. I hope my readings resonated with you. And if they did, I hope they make your lives better in one way or the other. Please share and subscribe and hit the bell to get notified. Thank you for watching.